just mentioned the Gospel of John, chapter number 15, verse number 34. When my father sends the Comforter, he shall glorify me. Look at John chapter 14, verses 15 through 18. It says, I will ask the Father, and he will give you another counselor to be with you forever, the Spirit of Truth. If you look at the context of this chapter, we'll see that there's no possible way this is referring to anything but the Holy Spirit. It says, The world cannot accept Him because it neither sees Him nor knows Him. Now clearly the people of the world know Muhammad and have seen Muhammad. Muhammad was a man who they could see. Whereas the Spirit of Truth, the Holy Spirit, is not seen by the world and not known by the world. But then the verse continues, You know Him, for He lives with you and will be in you. Notice, even at this time, Jesus' disciples are being told that this Comforter, the Spirit of Truth, is known to them because He is with them and He will live in them. Muhammad can't possibly fit this. Because you see, Muhammad wasn't known to them. And he wasn't with them. And he certainly can't be in them. And so it is not possible for Muhammad to be the spirit of truth, this counselor, this comforter of John chapter 14. 